All right, Suzune is finally a member of our cafe. I've been waiting for this moment. I knew it was going to happen. I'm just a matter of when. So she finally joined, and she's going to help clean up our act. Because she's like, hey, you know, your other food was good, but your pancakes sucked. <laughs> so she's going to help us make hopefully better ones. And we are going to have a successful cafe. Okay, we are so close to opening. I don't know if it'll be this episode, but hopefully it'll be soon. Because that'll be great. We decided that Suzune-san will be the full-time chef, whereas I'll be the sous chef and assist her during busy hours. Sounds like a good idea. I like this plan. The dining floor will be manned by our four waitresses. Here, Akazuki-san will be the... I don't even know how to pronounce that. All that's left to decide their shifts. Mikido has been tasked with most of the managerial work. Not only will it cover the food ordering, but the bookkeeping as well. Apparently, he knows how to do accounting and stuff, despite being a cat. <laughs> yeah, I don't think most cats probably know how to do that, so... Uh, that certainly makes him different. I'll have to take his word for it, but I have to wonder. Can he even use a keyboard with those pods of his? Well, he seemed pretty confident, so I'm sure he has a way. Our menu also has a few new items now. Okay, let's go. Two types of omelette rice, parfaits. Three types of pasta, cabanara caprice style. Okay, that one's new. Uh, pasta, tomato, and cheese. Unless that's just the same kind of tomato sauce pasta we had before. And then Japanese-style pasta. I feel like that's just some kind of noodles, but okay. All these dishes have drastically improved in quality thanks to Suzune-san's guidance. And also courtesy of her, we finally added pancakes to the menu. She even offered to make us cakes for us, too, available for takeout. Oh, sounds so good. It's a great idea that benefits us both. If our cafe starts getting a reputation for the cake, she may even be able to set up her own pastry shop in the future. Well, assuming what were that successful, of course. But baking cakes is hard work. In order to get everything ready, she needs to come to work at 7 in the morning. Consequently, I've taken up the morning shift too so I can help her out. I wonder how that works with uh, our school. I'm not much of an early riser, but as long as I go to bed early, it shouldn't be too much of a problem. Keeping early hours should be good for my health. At least that's what I tell myself. But more than anything, the hardest part about being Suzune-san's assistant is her strict training regimen. Gosh, she's so cute with like her little beret and just her little... She's got like an apron and then she's got a little like tie. It's adorable. I love it. You think I'll be able to handle it? Alright, yes ma'am. <laughs> I'll do my best. <laughs> he did say ma'am. <laughs> yes ma'am. Ew. Well, that's not really what I... Sorry. Sorry. Apparently, we hired a drill instructor who's also a pastry chef. Wow, okay. <laughs> She's pretty demanding, huh? Sir? <laughs> uh... <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> what? <laughs> um. Um. What? <laughs> um. I'm just gonna pretend you didn't say that. <laughs> My motivation is dying, sir. What? I'm, I'm so lost. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> There's more. Yes, sir. Oh my gosh. What? What is this game? What is this game, guys? Hoorah. By the way, you seem pretty into this whole Marine Corps thing. I mean, we're already getting pretty kinky with the role-playing here. No, you can't do that. You can't talk like that and then all of a sudden be really cute. Like, that's... What? <laughs> oh, 
Oh my gosh. I get the impression you're already plenty foul mouthed normally, though. Don't say that again. Please. Please stop saying that. I actually know your brother. Seriously, I'm about to hurl. You know, I wasn't sure what Suzune was going to be like once we got over this kind of sad mopey thing. Can we go back to the sad mopey thing? I like that better. It was a lot less traumatizing. My training continued like that. We overhauled the cafe's atmosphere, redesigned our uniforms, high rolled the necessary staff, and updated our menu. If even after all this, the landlady still didn't give us her approval, we have no choice but to beg. But for now, we've done all we can. And thus, we decided that we're ready to face the music. Sunday, October 18th. That's the day we scheduled for her visit. Cafe Stella to Shinigami no Cho! ドキドキする。夏目さん、そんなこわばった顔をしていてはダメですよ。ちゃんと笑顔で出迎えないと平気ですよ。ちゃんと練習だってしたんですから。自信を持って笑顔で頑張りましょう。Is she going to do it? Is she going to give us the best smile in the world? 笑顔で。笑顔で。はい、喜んで。それは居酒屋のノリです。いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、い
考えましたどうすればお客さんに来てもらえるかって We bring in more girls, obviously. 私一人だけじゃなく周りのみんなに助けてもらいながら考えてこういうお店にしましたそうケーキは美味しいコーヒーにも文句はない流行る理由はたくさんあるのにお客さんが絶対に来るとは言えない分かってますそれでも私はこのままじゃ諦められませんから仕入れの方はどうなってるの一日の客数や客単価の設定、uh, それから売り上げ目標は Hopefully Mikado has all this figured out because、uh, I don't think we've ever, ever talked about this そっちも計算してますなんとか無理のない範囲にできたと思います、hmm. ああもうダメだって言おうと思ってたのに大学に専念しなさいって言うつもりだったのよじゃあここまでされて拒否したら私が意地悪してるみたいじゃない Let's go わかった認めますこのお店は夏目ちゃんに任せます Cafe Stella is soon to be open for business ありがとうございます夏目ちゃんにほだされたここまでされてやっぱりダメとは言えないじゃないそれじゃあ意地の悪いおばあちゃんみたいだものそんなことは全然思っていません私のことを思ってくれてっていうのは分かってました It's coming together. むしろ申し訳ないと思ってますだったら今からでも撤回してくれていいのよ No way this is our cafe now get out of here <laughs> それはできません Slowly and calmly, Shiki san shakes her head from side to side. I don't know what this means. I don't know what this means. I don't know what So, Nara, Shoganai. Mizu show by the you know, ne. Jicomanzo could a kaja damenano. So no jicomanzo kuo, oka no hito ni staete, rikaish de morana kcha ikenai. Takarone, so no jidai ni awaseta egyo, kokoroga kena kcha ikenai. Probably very true. So de da kewa, oboito de. Hi. あと何か困ったことがあればいつでも言ってね。さんざん意地悪を言った私には頼りたくないかもしれないけれど。そんなことは本当に思っていませんってば。なるべく自分たちで解決するようにします。でも、万が一の時には何卒よろしくお願いします。うん。Alright. It's nice to see their work go appreciated, you know? I agree. The waking up so early from now on is going to be a pain in the butt. Yep. That's probably the most depressing part. Hey, not another bully. Yes, sir. I wouldn't put it past her to punch me for real. I'll have to make sure I don't give her an excuse to. So, the good I take any open why it's in his room, though. So, ne. すぐにオープンさせられるとは言ったけど、各所に改めて確認の連絡はしておく必要があるし。Yeah, we probably need to get like some kind of banner, like say grand opening, and we need to make sure we have like something that says that we're opening soon, so we can anticipate hype, right? 
There we go. This is why Kana's best girl. She thinks of what I think. Or I think of what she thinks. Sounds like a plan. Don't forget social media. We could take some fancy photos of Suzune-san's cakes and post them on Instagram. Hio Chidani-san, you and Nozomi use Instagram, don't you? Okay, I like this. Nice, that'd be great. I suppose that means we'll need to make an official account for the cafe. Never used Instagram before. Is making an account easy? Sure, let's do that. The sooner we set it up, the better. Okay, Instagram is fine, because that sounds very similar to the original, but Facehook? You couldn't have done anything else. Like, face look. You know, face look, that sounds dumb, but a little less dumb than Facehook. <laughs> okay, that's fine. I don't like the name, but we can make one. Whose email address should we use to register? Hmm. We have one? Wait, we actually have one. Yeah, I mean, that makes sense. Kana, you probably don't know what an email is. Exactly. Just how it is, Kana. Oh, and no one's saying that. No one's saying you couldn't figure it out. It's just you haven't done so yet. Brushing Akazuki-san aside, Mikido taps away at the phone. Wait, he has paws, doesn't he? Do touchscreens even work with feline digits? Imagining him pressing those stubby toes against the screen is... kinda cute. <laughs> I have noticed a lot of businesses do that. It's very interesting. They, they always put it in English, so I, I can find it, but then you look at the description of something and it's like in a different language. Very interesting. I suppose a lot of people outside of the United States or like the UK or Australia or somewhere like that, I guess they do use English, right? But it's just weird to me to think that a place like Japan uses so much English just because... Why would you use English? <laughs> ah, the US school system. Meanwhile, in other countries, they're learning English as a second language, and then I don't know any other language. I have I have so much trouble trying to pronounce some of the Japanese. Crazy. I asked Hiroto to do the same, but I bet you'd attract a lot more attention. <laughs> Alright. I like how Suzune just kind of came in as like a second boss. <laughs> She just knows so much more than everybody else about how to run a restaurant and things like that. And there you go, saying the same thing over and over. Awakened by neither the sound of my phone alarm nor Nozomi's voice. Now there's the sound of my doorbell ringing repeatedly. It's early dawn and the morning rush hasn't even begun yet. What the hell? Who would be ringing my bell at this hour? 
I wonder to myself as I clamber out of bed. Ah, frick. Pastry chefs really have early starts, huh? Probably. Well, good luck. <laughs> That's too early. No, please don't. I'm too tired. <laughs> Go say stop. Shut up. Oh my gosh. Quit giving me that disgusted look. I was kidding. It's a joke. Well, you know, apparently that's my life now. We got some prep work to do in the kitchen. You're pretty early yourself, for that matter. Ah, oh, right, I forgot you were renting a room here. That's fine, Tazune-san and I are the ones responsible for the kitchen. We might get really busy sometimes, but we're fine for today. I'm sure there'll be plenty of things that need your help with later, though. I will, thanks. I'm sure we'll have plenty of things that Kana can help us with later. Wow. Suzune-san's freshly baked madelines glisten appetizingly after being taken out of their molds. They look delicious. Okay, well, they can be delicious and look it. I admire your confidence. Fair point. Mind if I try one? Don't worry, I... Kosei, did you not learn from Hirito? Okay, you, you literally went through it twice, where he grabbed the hot drink and then took a sip and then spilled coffee. And then here you go grabbing hot things. Just like him. Toss a madeline into my mouth like a piece of popcorn. Ugh, so hot. Crispy on the outside, soft and fluffy on the inside. Fragrant and buttery. Buttery with just the right amount of sweetness. Dang, these really are delicious. These are going to be a hit for sure. I mean, that's just how a lot of pastries and things like that are. Uh-huh. <laughs> She's going to come back and they're just all going to be gone. <laughs> We're just going to eat all of them. Okay. Instead of simply handing out flyers, we decided it'd be, it would be more effective to give people a taste of our food, too. It's a good idea. Uh, if you guys have ever been to Jamba, I remember that, like, back before all, all this stuff happened in the past few years, like, they used to give out samples. Sometimes they would just be, like, at a mall or something, and they would just give them out. It was nice. Hence the Madelines. I tried one myself over there. They're really good. I'm sure they'll garner us lots of attention. <laughs> サービスのマドレーヌも完成したそれじゃあ配りに行きますかもったいなくありませんでもそのために作ってくれたんだから。そっちじゃなくてお店の宣伝をするなら、ふさわしい服装があるんじゃないかってことですいや、you gotta be in uniform, don't you? Yeah, I mean, you're gonna be working here in that, so what's the big deal? That's true. That's true. That's true. That's true. That's true. That's I mean, y'all are all wearing it. Yeah, 
Sono iki, sono iki. All right, I'm gonna go put these flyers in the neighborhood mailboxes. Alright, let's get her done. I began walking around the neighborhood handing out flyers to each house, but naturally I avoided mailboxes labeled with no flyer stickers. Let's say, is that a thing in Japan? I wouldn't want to hurt our cafe's image by annoying people with unwanted ads. So I'm guessing you came with me because the station's too close to your old workplace. <laughs> Probably. I like how she's still wearing her chef's outfit out here. You still hold a grudge against them, don't you? Well, it wasn't from him, but I more or less heard the whole story. You had a bad experience with your old workplace, didn't you? Oh, so that's where she learned some of the things she did. Fair enough. I heard the owner was treating you unfairly. Something about a patissier competition? あれはね。もともとはないで腕を競い合う本ペがあったんだよ。売り値設定500円ね。私はそれで負けたの。if you're so convinced, then why'd you quit? Yeah, that would be kind of hard to be like so passionate about it and then feel like you're being held back just because of cost. Like, of course, yeah, you need to make a profit, but surely you could find a way to make it still taste better while making money off of it. I do feel like there would be a very, like, a hard line to get that, like, just right. Yeah, I mean, I feel like if it was really that good, they could have just increased the price a little bit. I mean, I, I understand their goal was for it to be a little bit lower, but they could have introduced it. And you could always just take it away later. I mean, you're, you're going to probably make some people mad about that. But there's plenty of restaurants and things like that that have items that come and go. So, I don't know. For me, it wouldn't be a big deal. You sure it wasn't your old boss trying to sabotage you? <laughs> I mean, just because he had more experience than you didn't make him better. I mean, sure, he probably made a few items better, but... You know, it's good to bring in fresh talent, right? Like, even though you've been doing something for years, someone could come in who's a lot newer than you and teach you something, right? とはいえ、年度とは思ってても憎しみとかはないんじゃない？仕事は普通に厳しかったけど、嫌がらせとか支援でのパワハラを受けたことはなかった。私一人にそんな嫌がらせするほど向こうも暇じゃないよ。O
It's really weird hearing the word clout nowadays. Like, that, that wasn't really a word, like, so many years ago. So it's very interesting that we use that quite a bit now. Like, your reputation. Right, sorry for dragging all that stuff up. Oh, gosh, we're kiddo zoned. Well, the nice thing is, if for some reason we don't get all of them out, we just yeet them. <laughs> just throw them in someone's backyard. Well, dang, this is the worst state ever. We're splitting up. Like a episode of Scooby-Doo. Before I can even respond, she runs off. I could have sworn I saw a faint blush on her cheeks. Was she embarrassed? Oh, well, whatever. Let's get to work. Yeah, we got some... We got some work to do, not just for the cafe, but in trying to convince her that we are on her level. Because it seems like she sees us as a kid. To be fair, we are the same age as her brother. So that, that would be kind of difficult. It's been a few hours since she and I split up. I finished distributing my stack of flyers. Upon returning to the cafe, I found more waiting for me. I'll need to go hand these out, of course, but I'm a bit curious. I wonder how things are going at the station. カフェステラがオープンしますよろしくお願いしますよろしければこの Three of the girls are talking cheerfully and admissibly to pedestrians, while the lone other shouts awkwardly at reluctant looking bystanders. <laughs> well, this is about the best we could hope for. I'm glad things are working out relatively well. Relieved, I turn on my heel to go pick up the rest of the flyers in the cafe. Oh, hello, you're that uh, employee from the patisserie, Soran, right? She's the one who told me. Who told me and Hirito what happened to Suzune-san when we stopped by her workplace looking for her. And the employee currently holds a flyer and a madeleine in her hands. Thank you for your help the other day. I would say she's doing pretty good. She's uh, much improved. She's the one who baked that madeleine you have. So... Did, did we not just have this conversation that we don't want to let them know that she's working at a new job? Yep, we're planning to open next week. Nodding the girl unwraps her madeline and takes a bite. Well, maybe she'll be nice and not let every one of her coworkers know. We'll have the other freshly baked sweets and pancakes on opening day if you're interested. Alright, sounds good. Hope to see you there next week. Even this girl who works at a famous patisserie was impressed by Suzani's on baking. That should give us a nice boost of recognition. Now, let's get the rest of those flyers out there. I don't know, I feel like it's going to cause drama. Oh, it literally says Suzune is the boss, if you look in the bottom left there. Looking at the tart, the word photogenic springs to mind once more. The strawberries in particular look absolutely mouthwatering. She is very particular about that. Well, 
力ば味の確認をばほら写真を撮ってからだよインスタにあげるんだから<laughs> go in, go in. Uh, well, I've definitely been guilty of like taking a bite of something and then sending a picture to somebody. Done there. Done that, been there. Done that. Some, the saying goes something, okay? I'm, tr I'm tripping over my words. I quickly snap a few pics of a tart using the camera on my phone. Hmm, looks kind of boring. Yeah, well, they probably have a professional come and they probably like take different pictures of the food. Did you get Kosei to take the picture? That's probably why. No, you're definitely right. Not that I can really say anything since I'm the one who took it. I'll try taking a few more and see if we can get a lucky shot. Senpai, senpai, just wait. Place to change. What would you do? Yeah, you need good lighting, right? Ah, yeah. Of course, I know it's delicious. I know it's delicious. I'm aware of it. Just put a cute girl in the background, holding it. Well, okay. Good. Okay. Okay. Anyway. Gosh, that reminds me. So my phone literally has a picture taking mode for food and it like enhances it somehow. We're literally living in 2022 right now. It's crazy. Hi. Yep, you want good lighting. ね、関係ないものは映さないようにする。人の手とか鼻とかそういうのもなしです。主役となるものをアップで斜めから撮る。あと真ん中に配置するんじゃなくて少し隅に寄せるとか。I mean, if you're gonna put it on Instagram, literally just use a filter, and it'll make it look great. Well, either way, I'm glad we have you. Without your guidance, we'd be stuck with these crappy pictures I took. We all gather around and peer down at our phone screen. I don't know, why didn't you just say I looked gross? I mean, why even say the picture? Just insult me, why don't you? I have to agree. Good idea, let us know what they say. Still, it's above zero, isn't it? Wonder if there's anything we can do to get more followers. Yep. Yeah, I mean, if it looks like good food, people will like it. They're saying we'll naturally gain more followers if we keep posting more pics of the cakes Suzune san bakes for us. Yeah, I think like do maybe like once a week, just do like a picture of one of the food items and like put some kind of tag on there or like, uh, what is it? Like a description for it? 
メニューに載ってるのは全部写真を撮ってあげるようにしないとあそうですねそれがいいと思います Like maybe like if it's a cold day you can just like maybe take a photo of like someone holding the coffee like not like the person but just like their hands with the coffee and just like put like the chilly day why don't you warm up with some nice coffee from Cafe Stella I don't know just an idea てなわけでちゃんと見栄えよく作れるようになること I'll try ケーキやオムライスの写真も重要だけど必要なことだけっていうのは少し味気なくないかな Yeah, I, I mean, I think once you guys get going, you could do like some kind of events we're having. Like, we're gonna have a special tonight. I don't think it's a bad idea. Posting a variety of pictures might help us gain more followers, as long as we do it in moderation. Well, we do have one around. We've talked about this before. Dad mentioned that too, as a matter of fact, cats, strawberries, and pancakes, provided that he doesn't have to serve any of our cust any customers, our resident cat might be willing to help us out. I'll try talking to Akazuki san and Shiki about it later. Well, I'll see what we can do. <laughs> いいじゃん、美味しそう。お店がオープンしたら絶対に行くからって来ました。営業成功ですね。Nice. あ、まだあった。もう少し横からもっと近くで撮ってみれば。もっと？結構近づけるんだね。背景とかも本当に邪魔なものが入らないようにするんだね。こんな感じかな。Well, I mean. It can also help if you have like a better camera and lens. If they're just taking it on their phone, it's probably not going to look that great. Sounds so good. Kind of like dinner time right now. I'm like hungry. Alright, let's go. Let's get her done. So I can eat those next. <laughs> oh, yay, we called her ma'am this time instead of sir. That was a little weird. <laughs> Our little cafes coming together. Ooh, opening day, and we're in chapter three now. That's awesome. Let's go. Oh, yeah, I'm sure she's very, very nervous. Promotional flyers and Instagram posts. There had been a small but growing response to our advertising efforts. Some people commented on the taste of our Madelines. Others who had seen our posters came in to check out the cafe before it opened. In addition, we'd also started to see our follower count social media go up. Considering where things were when we started, we made great progress. All thanks to Suzune-san's baking. And we can't forget His Excellency, either. Can't believe we still call him that. Kotowaru. <laughs> Kotowaru. <laughs> well, I knew you'd say that. I knew you'd say that. Yeah, go be a good cat and let us take your picture. He doesn't respond. Oh, Furukake makes rice so much better. Oh, yeah, I would love to see you as a cat. Just go walk up to them and say, Hey, my owner's not feeding me very well. <laughs> 
We're all against him. I mean, you are a cat after all. カッカは勘違いを捨ています。求められているのは写真だけで人を魅了する気品です。それは貴族であるカッカにしか持ち得ないものです。貴族であるワガハイにしか。カッカ、why <laughs> So they're just gonna take a picture of him and everyone's gonna comment, Oh, how cute! Gosh, Kana sure knows how to uh, navigate him well. まあ、それでも難しいとおっしゃるならば、無理強いはできません。諦めるしかないでしょうね。できないのであれば。<laughs> バカを言うな。その程度私にかかれば大変すいことだ。では、写真の件お願いできますか。仕方あるまい。そこいらの猫にはない。格の違いを見せつけてくれる。I really hope when they take the picture and if they show it, it just looks like a normal cat, like you can't even tell. カリカリだけというの嫌だしな。ありがとうございます。Women scare me sometimes. <laughs> Same, my guy. Same. I'm married to one, I would know. Imanoakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakak
Yeah, I'm sure we'll get more too, like once people actually know like what our quality is and you know they can share it with their friends. So we reached over 500 followers. Wow, that's a lot. So I'd say we garnered some attention. I mean, that's not really high, but I think for a restaurant that hasn't even opened yet, that's pretty good. Said it was pretty amazing. It has only been less than a month since we started, and we've only just opened. Apparently, our follow count experienced a sudden surge these past few days. All thanks to the pictures of you we posted, I'm sure. He's so happy with himself, even though everyone just found him cute. That is true. It's not really like a good indication that like people near us are following. Not very optimistic, are you? That's fair. That's fair. Alright, let's do it. That's Feels like you're just piggybacking what she said, though. Right, last thing we need to do is inconvenience our customers. Sounds fair. I mean, this is, in a way, not Sumi's cafe. Oh boy, hope we're ready. Alright, let's get her done. Oh, that's her dad. お客様いらっしゃいました。いらっしゃいませ。なるほど。随分と明るくなったな。店も人も。よ、来たぞ。Welcome, please have a seat. Ah. Right behind you. Pass the baton to Akazuki san, Susune san, and I return to the kitchen. You could say that. That was my dad, actually. <laughs> no, nothing like that. He had a hand in helping us set up the cafe. So he's just swinging by to see how everything turned out. Alright, let's do it. Sounds so good. Yeah, I got it. I practiced making this dish countless times over the past few weeks. I've had dad taste test it for me on multiple occasions. Now that I'm serving it for real, though, I can feel the pressure starting to get to me. In, out, in, out. All right, let's do this. After taking a few deep breaths, I pick up my knife. Well, hopefully our first day goes well. Despite my nervousness, the soft-cooked omelette rice comes out perfectly. The runniness is just right, and even Suzune-san had nothing but praise for it. After about 15 minutes after the omelette rice was brought out, the cheesecake was brought out as well. I wonder how our customer is enjoying his meal. Ooh. <laughs> It'd be a weird look for the kitchen staff to keep popping in and out of the dining floor. Right, 
Oh, say, you're a little nervous, huh? So I try to keep myself still. I hear a thank you for coming from beyond the door. A short while later, Akazuki-san enters the kitchen to return the empty plates. Did he say anything? Nice. She's right. His plate is perfectly clean. He ate all of it down to the last drop of tomato sauce I'd poured all over it. Oh, so he really liked it. Well, we should probably see if we can get some more customers other than our dad, or we're not going to really have a business going. Akazuki-san shakes her head ruefully. Oh. Well, I guess things don't always work out the way you want. Yeah, I mean, nobody really knows we're here. I mean, we handed out flyers and, and social media and stuff, but, you know, people are still going to work around their own schedule. They're not just going to come in when you want them to. I guess you're right. Getting impatient won't change anything. Yep. Sounds like a plan. Taking Suzune-san's advice, I mentioned prepare for a boring day at work. Thankfully, however, things quickly begin to pick up around noon. Alright, I like it. Order up Capri-style pasta and cabanara. Dang, yeah, we are getting pretty busy, huh? I'll take care of those. That's great to hear. Alright, we're on it. Smiling cheerfully, she carries the plate of pancakes out the door. Seriously, though, it's a relief to see the customers finally trickling in. Yeah, for sure. Oh, well, thanks for the vote of confidence. I worked in the kitchen at a diner and pub before, so I've got a bit of experience, yeah. I even basically had to man the kitchen myself during peak hours on weekends. Compared to that, this was pretty easy. I screwed up often back then, causing my bosses to yell at me that they continue to pile shifts on me without giving me help, but I digress. I should be focusing on my current task, making these omelet rices. Alright. As Suzune-san had predicted, things gradually settled down as it got later into the day. Once lunchtime had passed, Nozomi and Hiyo... Hiyo chidani san arrived for their afternoon shifts. And at last, there came a pause in the flood of orders for pasta and omelet rice. However... Oh boy. Yeah, look at that. We got some customers in here, and they got all types of crazy hair colors. It's great. Apparently, Suzune-san's Madelines had caused a bit bigger of a stir than we could have imagined. I'm almost done. I'll bring the cake out myself so you can go do something else, Nozomi. Hey, now, there's always something to do. Like, scrub the floors. Visit each table, make conversation, exchange pleasantries. Time, woman, we need time. I am, I am there. How's this look, boss? Okay. Alright. Here, I'll help you carry the tarts. More strawberry tarts. Yes. So this is a ton of customers, too many for comfort. Just what on earth caused us boom. Oh, hey. How's it going? 
Wow, really? I was worried about. So you're saying all these customers found out about us because he liked our posts on Instagram. Oh, okay. So he actually helped us out. Interesting. Unlike our cafe, it is unusual to see lines forming outside of Patisserie Soran. The truth of the matter is, these people must be their customers who decide to stop by to give ours a try as well. Okay. Yeah, apparently. Hey, that's fine. I don't think Suzune-san herself is too bothered by it. Fair enough. Ah, oh, a bit of a tsundere, isn't he? <laughs> I think she's busy. The kitchen's a bit hectic right now with all these unexpected customers. Rest is surged, though. She's enjoying every minute of it. Okay. Sounds good. Oops, look at the time. I gotta get back. Yeah, we're just running a busy restaurant and we're out here talking. So I'll get right back to work. She's like having a breakdown. Well, I've never seen you lose her cool like this. I would feel like cakes you could probably like keep in a fridge, wouldn't you? Like there, there's no way some of these restaurants out here are just baking cakes on demand. Like they, they're probably keeping them in a fridge. So they can keep them for a few days, you know? And then maybe like after like two days, they'll like be like, okay, we need to get rid of this if it doesn't sell. Dang, we have brownies? Yes, sorry, you'll have to tell the people we're sold out for today. Dang, really selling out on the first day, huh? Since we have dining customers to deal with on top of that, things are even more hectic than they were at lunch. You can cry about it later. Come on, I'll do the pancakes. Gosh, they're really breaking out Mikado, huh? <laughs> That's how you know it's busy. Well, we made it through the first day, though. <laughs> you worked hard today. Want me to massage your shoulders? Yeah, don't worry. I wouldn't let Kosei touch me, either. It's a pretty big grin on your face considering how tired you are. Alright, I forgot to tell you, apparently it had something to do with Patisserie Soran. I can explain what I had heard from her former co-worker. She listens to me with a puzzled expression on her face. I thought you said you two weren't on bad terms. Doesn't that just mean he acknowledges your skill? I mean, it benefits him too. Nothing wrong with that. But he doesn't want your talents to be wasted. Otherwise, he wouldn't have mentioned the fact that you trained you. Yeah, 
I mean, I feel like if he really cared about you, he wouldn't want you to work at his store forever. He would want you to move on and, and do greater things if he thought you were capable. Okay. I mean, let's not do that. I'm sure his food's still really amazing. Thought you weren't gonna go around picking fights. You're going for one of those students surpasses the master scenarios. Oh, uh, yes, indeed. I've definitely heard that one before. Who said that again? Aristotle? Okay. I've already got the credits I need to graduate, but anyways, I hope it's as busy tomorrow as it was today. How many cakes do you think we should bake for tomorrow? Yeah. Could be a lot of people just trying them out. But for the time being, why don't we check which cakes sold the most today and make more of those? Sounds good. That's what I want to do after work, too. Ugh. Sometimes I just want to die. Want me to call us a cab? Long day. Yep. Gosh, I bet our sales were like crazy. Very true. I mean, it's her opening day. Like, of course it was going to be busy. Sounds like a plan. Well, now we kind of know what to expect, so that's good. Doesn't look like I have anything to worry about. Our kitchen can get dizzyingly busy sometimes, and she has to deal with an amateur cook like me to boot. Some might call that a stressful work environment. But the expression on Suzune's face is joyful and full of life. You really do love baking, don't you? Yeah. That's what makes you a good chef. I guess you could say there's nothing sweeter, eh? <laughs> oh, we're breaking out the bad puns now. So glad you ignored us. Come on, nobody thought those were funny. <laughs> Oh, I feel real bad having to be comforted by Nozomi. That's supposed to make me feel better. Oh, 
人が恥ずかしいのをこらえて話してるのにとにかくこのお店で雇ってもらえたことも後悔してないまだ初日だけどさありがとう私にケーキを作らせてくれて Hey, we're just glad for the help, okay? We needed it. So, no, Cochiracoso, Arigato, Gosimus. So, any Susan Sandakejanak Mina Arigato Conani Sogashkunar to a motte nakatakara Kuro or Kakete, Gomenasai. Hey, you know, it, it would be hard to tell how many people we're gonna have. Demo, Norikireta no more. Mina Gai de Greta Caragato, Motemas. Well, 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 I thought getting sentimental wasn't your style. Uh, that's not what we meant. <laughs> <laughs> so you took a look at Kawaii. This kid, a money man, don't go to Bakari, did it all. Show you, put it as a chance. You don't you are who they will see the tongue with a kid at Kao, Makanish, the Shojo, Kujirasa, did no so chinoxeni. So let all Koreto, Hanasika, it's to you. He's the type who likes to tease others, but can't handle getting teased yourself. Well, I'm glad the game acknowledges it too. That's the impression I got from her. はい、はい。営業を終えてもまだ気持ちが冷めないのはわかる。今日と同じぐらいの人が来る可能性が高いんだから、早く家に帰って休まないと。ほら、ちゃっちゃと片付けるよ。はい。I'm home. Oh,お帰り。Oh, what are you doing here, Dad? Upon returning to my apartment, I find my dad waiting for me. He's gripping a large travel suitcase. You're leaving for work? Well, good timing. Sounds like a plan. Alright, by the way, you never told me what you thought of the food today. Our own dad's calling us then. Just to answer the question. More or less. Alright. Zune-san's the one who baked the cake, so I can't take the credit for it. But it makes me happy nonetheless to hear him praise our cafe. Just a little bit. Oh, leave me alone. If you're really that worried, then please don't forget to deposit the rent next time. <laughs> hey! Okay. Sounds fair. Oh. With that, my dad prepared to leave. After saying our goodbyes, I quietly watched him go. Well, there you go, guys. Our cafe is up and running. I'm going to end the video here. We had our first successful day. I think that makes for a great video and a great episode. Oh, lots of people came. That was nice. Uh, it was good to, good to see that we stayed busy. I wonder how this is going to tie in now to our goal of what this cafe is, you know, to attract those butterflies, right? And we're going to, like, hopefully send them to the afterlife or wherever they might go. Hopefully we'll, we'll get some more information about that, because I'm sure this novel's not just completely about a cafe where they're just cooking food and the same thing happens every day, because that wouldn't make for a good story. I'm sure we'll we'll see some kind of drama or some kind of uh, twist in the story here soon. 
So I'm looking forward to that. But I'm glad our first day went well. Uh, that, that's always nice to see. But anyways, you guys, I hope you enjoyed that. I will see you in the next episode.